Right, first time at uh, Wild Man Woods. It's quite cold. Sit rep. Shelter is up. So this is the is it 4x4 DD tarp? One walking pole. Well, I don't think anybody's gonna ask me to uh, demonstrate how I put this up because it is rickety, sketchy. Anyway, it's shelter, so that's fine. I'll give you a tour on the outside and then we'll go and have a look at the camp and meet some of the lads. Morning folks, um, the traditional trangier is now alight, I filled the, uh, the trangier stove up and then put it in my pocket to warm it up because it is quite cold, um, we've had a lot of wind and uh, quite a lot of rain, I however am dry and toasty, the tarp has stayed up exactly as it should, nothing to complain about. Um, there's a good few people here. Uh, I've never met any of them in person before, and uh, what a crack. Yeah, we were up till nearly midnight last night, and um, yeah, I've learnt quite a lot. A um, couple of new resources, places to get things, places to look for things. Yeah, very positive, really enjoying it. So, today I'm doing a navigation course, just teaching uh, some map and compass skills. And then there's uh, a gentleman doing a, a flint and steel demonstration. And uh, I've actually got a flint and steel on me, which I got off Amazon. And other people may or may not have got the same steel and are having trouble lighting it. Now, I've not really played with mine yet. Um, so there's a chance that we're going to get that working and see what it's all about. Stay tuned. I'm not going to show you the, the first tarp configuration because it was abysmal. However, with help, it now looks like this.
Morning campers, um, just having breakfast, had the same as I did yesterday, uh, used the saucepan on top of the frying pan as you saw, just to warm up the bread bun, because obviously that's at you know, floor temperature and that worked really well. Um, the, the weather was great last night, there was no wind, definitely no rain, definitely no hail, which we've, all, which we've had this weekend all the time. Um, I don't think you'll believe how big this actual setup is. So it's time to pack away and um, yeah, I'll show you around the camp a little bit as well and uh, give you a bit of an overview, it's fantastic, love it. Um, very short walk in, there's a quad that you can load all your heavy stuff on so you can more or less bring barbecues, anything you like up here, it's fantastic, um, £5 a night, uh, yeah, loved it, absolutely loved it, uh, great people. Um, Tracy and Carl, they're fantastic, they've got so much passion and energy for it. Uh, John, the actual landowner, he's uh, regularly popping up, uh, not checking on you, just out of interest. He likes to see people using the woodlands. And um, the, the history that's attached to this place is phenomenal. Uh, very, very, very interesting place. And yeah, I've learned so much this weekend. Brilliant. Always trusted too much, it was all I had I was blind to the darkness and everyone I know Whoa. Always looked for the good or the best intent After years that have passed, I see all the signs I missed 